Hi guys, it's DJ here from Cozy RC. Thank you for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to show you how I made this rudder system. It's a fully DIY build, so let's go. I want to say a huge thank you to all of you. I recently passed the 2000 subscriber mark, which I'm really stoked about. I really enjoy the boating community. I made new friends from all over the world. I also learned a lot from all of your comments and your supports. And I hope that you may also have learned something from my content. Now it's time to give back to the boating community. So you can win a free prop. It's really easy to compete. Just leave a comment below this video. And from all the commenters, I will pick one winner. And I will select the winner just by a lottery pick. So let me know in your comments what kind of prop, the diameter and the pitch you would like to have. If you are the lucky winner, I will contact you. I will sharpen and balance the prop for you and I will send it to you free of charge.
rudder system is finally done. It took me a lot of time. I think I easily spent more than 20 hours on the whole assembly. My rudder system is a little bit unconventional because my hinge block is overlapping the rudder bracket, where normally this hinge block is in between the rudder bracket. But the height of my stock material, I thought was not enough to put the hinge block in between. So I went for the hinge block on top and on the bottom of the rudder bracket. During the build, I realized that I missed the position for the rudder arm on the hinge block. I just started with this part. Then I needed to make this second part with the rudder arm, basically going from the top of the hinge block to the bottom. So it's connected by the four bolts in order to mount the lever for the steering. This time I made a T bracket, which is much stronger than an L shaped bracket. The rudder blade itself is a two millimeter carbon fiber rudder blade. And it hinges on a single M4 bolt. So when I hit something, it can rotate upwards. Due to the long rudder arm, which is 150 millimeters, I added this brace to give it more stiffness. So yeah, altogether, I'm really happy how it turned out. And I hope to test it in the water soon. Don't forget to leave your comments if you want to win a prop. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.